Alright, I'm going to attempt to eat this Carolina Reaper. I have been growing this thing since March, and uh, from a seedling. Typically, the seeds take about two to four weeks to be able to germinate, and uh, it did just that. And it took pretty much all the rest of the year, it's now October, middle of October, uh, for me to get a right pod. This is actually the first pod that I got on my first Reaper plant. And uh, I'm going to go ahead and give it a try. And uh, pretty sure it's a bad idea. We've got milk, we've got ice cream, we've got cold water, and uh, I'm going to try to attempt at least at least a minute and a half without uh, resorting to the milk or the ice cream. We'll probably use the water to wash the solids down, but we'll give this a try. And uh, such such a bad idea. Uh, we'll just skip, we're just going to do it. Doing it thoroughly. Lots of heat. Going down. <clears throat> That's a really deep heat. Still building. <clears throat> Make sure I get the solids down. <sighs> Pretty sure water just makes it worse. Throat's pretty much burning. See what time we're at. <clears throat> Not so much the tongue, but really the back of the throat. Great day out here to burn out your intestines. You'll hit the stomach.
That's the first reaper pod on the plant. take me out for the rest of the day. <clears throat> Subsiding in the throat a little bit. A little bit. in the stomach though. Two of the biggest branches down, about 50 of the reapers, are all still green. And I uh, needed to put the, those branches on life support. 
basically stick them into a, a bucket of uh, water and let the, the pods uh, try to mature even though they lost the leaves. Many of the pods actually turn red. And the two remaining branches have about another 15 more reapers and that's right now going to uh, ripen up in the path in the next couple weeks here. Built a little uh, greenhouse for him here in central Indiana, middle of October. We're uh, looking at not very warm days anymore, and that plant really likes it to be warm. So, uh, trying to get a couple more weeks out of the season so I can get those reapers to ripen. That's just about it. Oh, my nose is running. Just about gone. Clocking up my ears somehow. That's it. So that worked out pretty well. Oh, I owed it to that first pod to eat that. Good enough for me to form really early in the, in the, in the summer. It took a while for it to, to ripen, but eventually it did. But proud of that little pod, the first one. another 70 or 80 pods all together that I needed to uh, dehydrate and grind up into a powder and use that for some barbecue sauce. But yeah, I owed it to this, it's the very first pod to, to, to eat it. Just, just take it down, see what happens. But uh, <clears throat> pretty much done with the, the throat. And no, nothing more than a jalapeno at this point, in terms of the heat that's left over. So I'm going to call this video done. And, uh, it's a great day. Hopefully I can still enjoy the rest of the day. It's going to be in the stomach. It's going to be in the intestines. It's going to hurt on the way out. So oh, to that little that little pod to do that though. I'll do it once. I do it once. Got some great photos of that of that pod too. Let's see, where are we? We are eleven minutes in. And I'm going to call this one done. Thanks, Reaper. I'll be thanking you again in at least 24 hours. Enjoy.